Well, if you haven't already noticed, the glitz and glamour of Rosemount Australian Fashion Week is well underway and the clothes are only the half of it with hours of primping and preeming going on behind the scenes before models hit the catwalk. Now, of course, uh, the week wouldn't be complete without a morning show visit from the makeup master himself, Napoleon Purtis. Joining him direct from the front row is celebrity editor and social commentator for S Magazine, Joe Casamento. Good morning to you both. Good Hi, morning. Sammy. Welcome to the show on a busy week. Uh, Napoleon, welcome back to Australia. Uh, now, what you're going to do is show us one of this season's top makeup trends, right? So, on our lovely model Adriana here. Uh, tell us about it. Where do we start? Well, there's this beautiful matte skin that I'm seeing, that I'm doing, continuing with all the kind of runways, 17 shows I'm working on. The blush is Kate Middleton did do it yourself blush. <laughs> blush, 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 do it yourself, put on a little bit of. And now I'm going to use a lipstick that is an orange. Lipstick is very in, whether it's orange, pink, or red. But I'm going to use an orange one, which is very much influenced by the Carla Spetik show. And I just love the way it's very luxurious and just mm. kind of adds to the whole simplicity of the look but still very evening and ready to go from day to dinner and that's that's what i love about this look nothing skin a little bit of blush and then lipstick day to dinner you go day to dinner joe what's the best way to pair this makeup with the okay. runway trends that we've seen so far this well, week well i think what i'm noticing a lot of is is this pop of color which is coming out in the lips there it's definitely a little bit of neon i've noticed a little bit of yellow or a hot pink a lot of the shows just have a little bit of elastic on the shoe or you know a, a bright accessory and that's what's coming across i mean obviously what we see on the catwalk is uh, has got to be democratized for, <laughs> for the everyday yeah. person uh, to break it down i mean i don't know that we could all get around in the really short shorts that are on the catwalk you know you want to in another life right. but hey. Okay. Yes. So, Napoleon, um, you did the uh, makeup for designer Alex Perry, made some headlines during the week for his colourful collection, right? What was your favourite bit from that? Collection? You know, I just love the whole purple and gold, very Cuban princess. There it is there on the screen. You know, the lines are kind of this hint of ori oriental, but the Cuban princess, Latino, rich and expensive. Alex Perry is expensive, expensive. luxurious, expensive. you know, couture evening wear society. I love that. I love the matte skin again, matte skin, uh, paring down the lips when you've got more dramatic eyes. So. You know, on the model here we have, on Adriana, we have the orange lips, n nude eyes. Mm -hmm. On Alex Perry it was strong eyes, nude lips, you know, so I love that. So you that. don't do both? No, I wouldn't Definitely do both, do. no. Mm -hmm. And I've used the white eyeliner inside, look how beautiful that I is. I did notice that, loved that. Can I ask with that one we just saw from Alex Perry, would, yes. you, wear the, would you actually... Or is I think it you like have to translate it. I don't think you can obviously do the full extent that Napoleon has done here, yeah. but you can add a little bit of purple under the eye or a bit of eyeliner, a bit of... Just see, I can see Carly bit. doing that yes. for the opening night of Avatar 2. Oh. <laughs> I have two rules for ladies out there. The catwalk inspires you. When you take a little bit of colour, dab it on as a wash, leave it on for 12 minutes. Mm. Once you go past that 10 minute mark, you're like, I feel okay. And then you can maybe leave it on at that. If you want to get a little bit more daring, you pump it up. But yeah. just take the colours, wear them in with everything in a little bit. Only little doses. Okay, well, you had some killer lashes too, didn't you? For, that was for the Close Sabatini. For with Sabatini, love, 20 year anniversary for Margie yeah. and Sabatini. Love these. I've got a, a human hair lashes that have been stuck wow. onto the lashes there that gives this luxury richness. I just look how beautiful that eye oh. looks. It just looks instant. And you can, again, people are wearing lashes to work yeah. now. Yep. Um, but you can also just wear it coming out in the evening and if you do nothing else other than a lash and gloss, you're kind of done. Yeah, love it. Can we do those lips at home though? They're, they're quite bright. Well, you know what, you can just put a bit on your, on your finger and just tap it on and yeah. then it's a stain and then, and then you pump it up in the evening. Yeah. Right. Could it. you leave me some of that because I would like to put that on Carly in the next commercial break. <laughs> okay, good. I want you to. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. Thanks, Thank Napoleon. You guys. Thank you. All right, and for Napoleon's commentary on Fashion Week, just grab a copy of the Sun Herald's S Magazine this Sunday with Napoleon on the cover. You won't be able to miss that. Thanks, guys. Good <laughs> Thank to see you. Too. Just ahead, find out why Piers Morgan was tweeting about the morning show. Yeah, an exclusive...